have my owl open. I've saved it to a new name so that I would not overwrite my original owl. And the next thing I need to do is to decide what parts of the owl that I want to delete. I know that I want to delete the purples and I want to delete the yellows, the browns. So I will select them and then press delete on my keyboard. Now I will save the owl again. And the next thing I will do is to change the colors. There are several ways that you can change colors in the software. So this is just one of many ways. First thing I want to do is to change the background, the face of the owl. I'm going to go down to the bottom. I'm going to select this color, double click it to make it active color. Then go to your My Threads, find the color that you want it to be, and double click on it, and then it will change that color. I want to change the greens to a lighter blue, so I'm going to go down to the bottom, double click to make it the active color, go back to my thread box. I know I want it to be flag blue. Found it, double click, and then it will change those colors. You do need to take the flag and remove it to be able to bring your colors back. I also want to change the orange. Another way that you can change colors is to select the color chips in your resequence docker, I will click, hold my control key, click the next orange, find the color that I want it to be, bright yellow, and double click. Before I save this design again, I want to select all, control A, and I want to group it. And then I will click save again. 